A warning about the safety of a popular kind of lettuce. Should you be concerned? We talk to the experts now. Here's the information that we can tell you. The Center for Disease Prevention says there is an E. coli outbreak they have traced to the food. It stretches across 16 different states. At last check, 53 people have become sick from E. coli. 31 have been hospitalized and five of those have developed a kidney failure. Our Michael Fuller is on your side with the details about the recall. Well, if you're like me, you love a good salad. Now, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention said Wednesday the nationwide E. coli outbreak is linked to romaine lettuce. They have not yet narrowed it down to a brand or a specific grower, but they know it comes from the Yuma, Arizona area. The CDC says all chopped romaine lettuce, including salads and mixes with romaine, should not be eaten but thrown away. Now, according to the CDC, with this type of E. coli, people typically get sick within two to eight days of swallowing the germ, which can cause diarrhea, stomach cramps, and vomiting. Now, the CDC is providing tips for consumers and retailers about ways to stay safe. So for consumers, First, wash and sanitize drawers or shelves in refrigerators where chopped romaine was stored. Secondly, if you would like to purchase romaine lettuce at a store or in a restaurant, you can still do so, but consumers should confirm with the store or restaurant that the product is not from the Yuma, Arizona region. If you can't confirm it, then just don't buy it. And for retailers and restaurants, don't serve or sell any chopped romaine lettuce from Yuma, Arizona. Now, you may need to ask your suppliers about the source of the product to double check that they are safe to give your customers. In studio, Michael Fuller, News 19, WLTX.